Hi friends, in this video I'm going to talk about one of the basic Java question. What happens when an object is created in Java? So I've written a very simple code example to explain the same. So first step will be the memory will be allocated to hold the instance variables and implementation specific data and its superclass variables. Then the second step is initialization happens in the sense the objects are initialized to their default values. Then third step constructor chaining the sense from your base class from your concrete class till the uh, to the parent class and till java.lang object the constructors are called so that so all your parent class uh, or variables are properly constructed okay that's what called as constructed chaining so from your concrete class till java.lang.object class all the constructors will be called okay then the first step is initial instance block will be called before the constructor is executed all the instance variables are initialized and instance block will be executed so let me debug this and show you so I'm going to debug this I have a class I'm going to create an object so here using new operator I'm going to create the object you can see first the instance block will be called this is called as instance block there is something called static block and instance block whenever you create an object the instance block will be called you can initialize some value to it then the constructor will be called see the constructor is getting called now our object is ready and and we have started using our object okay so these are the things happens during the creation of an object in Java. Hope this video is useful. Thank you.